for Renegade Fortress. We're a small development company, uh, originally working in mobile games, but we transferred into mixed reality. So we are working mainly with uh, the HoloLens, but also other depth field technology like Project Tango. We're using these to help provide business solutions for data visualization and uh, anywhere where else that we think mixed reality can help with businesses. My name is James Met. I'm the technical coordinator at the Eagle Lab at the Lambda Community City UK. I was approached by Ash from Renegade Fortress, uh, who I was aware was doing a lot of mixed reality work with the HoloLens. Uh, he informed me that Microsoft had just released the designs for a spectator view mount as well as the software allowing them to effectively give spectators a view of what someone in the HoloLens is seeing. Right, so what we made was what is called spectator view. So we made a rig uh, that attaches a HoloLens on top of a, a camera that we can record in up to 4K what someone using a HoloLens is interacting with and can see. It. The main reason I um, put this rig together was that uh, it's a good way of demonstrating what the HoloLens can do. So when I was first in development for it, uh, we was finding that it's a very singular experience. So uh, only the person using it could experience what the HoloLens is doing. So this allows other people to see what they are doing at the same time. Microsoft had previously done their own version of Spectator View using an expensive machined rig uh, and really expensive 4K cameras. What they offered their users and developers by putting these parts and designs online was an opportunity for them to create them for themselves. Um, they actually advised to only see and see the parts using aluminium, saying that they probably wouldn't get the right tolerances on a 3D printer. Uh, I thought we could probably manage, uh, tried it and actually built the part using laser cut acrylic and 3D printed parts. I came across this while I was actually trying to get uh, a third person perspective on it. I originally was looking at the Connect to use that to record viewpoint. As I was looking on the forums, I found that Microsoft have actually uploaded onto GitHub the software and plans to uh, 3D print the rig and also the software to composite the two viewpoints together. When I got the plans, it actually had 3D models of the actual attachment for the HoloLens onto the camera. And um, I went to Eagle Labs and looked at the plans and told me the best way that we can actually 3D print the components and laser cut the acrylic on top and put that together in a, a cheap and effective way. It's great for businesses within the landing to be able to access the Eagle Lab so easily uh, to be able to create new and interesting prototypes such as this.